middle of Manhattan, New York City. I am standing outside of Maki Maki Sushi where they specialize in hand rolls over here. So what's really cool is that this place, they specialize in their hand rolls with the seaweed being extra super fresh. So yeah, most hand rolls you get, you know, um, it's already wrapped and stuff. And then if it kind of sits there for a little bit, it gets soggy. Um, but this place has a very special way of preparing their hand rolls. So let's go inside this place and check it out. Cannot wait to eat some sushi. Yay! As you enter, it's a really cute place. Ooh, look at all these drinks I can choose from. Ooh, tea too. All right, guys, these are all their sushi handles on display here. So this is what I mean. It's packaged like this. Isn't that cool? And here's an instruction palette on how you unwrap it. So we're gonna try unwrapping it first before we're eating all of this, but this looks amazing. Oh my gosh, we got salmon, we've got some tamago, we got some tuna, we got eel, crab, avocado, tempura. All looks so good. All right, guys, so this is what I'm talking about. So they gave me an instruction on how to do it. First, you pull the red tab and then you pull it out. So let's see. Step one, peel it out from here. Ooh. Okay. It's all perforated, so it's really easy. And then. Step two, you pinch and pull from the tip. Oh. Cool. Oh, and there you go. And the seaweed comes out just like that. So this way, since um, the seaweed is covered with this wrapping, it stays nice and crispy, so it's not too soggy from all the food. So excited to try it out and try this food. Yum. All right, guys, let's get started on this. I got some golden oolong tea. Also got some jasmine green tea. These are both unsweetened, so healthy, healthy drinks. And my Diet Coke, as always. Okay, let's start off with this veggie one. It's got some pickled radishes in there, some cucumbers, and a carrot. So I'm excited. So unwrap it like this. Pinch the bottom. Oh. And then pull it from the top. I have never experienced a handle like this. All right, all right, let's try it out. Mm. Oh, wow. The rice is so good. Really fresh veggies and rice. No, oh, no, I dropped a little piece. Dip in some of the soy sauce. Oh yeah, that was too much wasabi at one time. <laughs> it's really good though. Alright, let's try the avocado one next. <clears throat> this is so fun. I actually really like this. And it's such a different experience to like not have the handles like super soggy. Right. Look how pretty it is.
just to the side so the soy sauce can be a little bit closer. Sushi rice with soy sauce is so good. Alright, which one should I try next? Let's try the tamago one, the eggs. sushi is like sweet it's like an omelet like a sweet omelet it's really good mm. and these are big handles too look they give you a good amount of rice with everything They also have some cupy mayonnaise on them. Cupy mayonnaise is so good. Salmon is beautifully cooked. Oh my gosh. It's awesome. Mm. I need some more wasabi to my soy sauce. Uh, it definitely adds up eating this many hand rolls. Oh, there's so much rice. Whew, so much carbs. All right, let's try this crab one. Got some crab and cucumbers and avocados with this. I definitely taste a huge difference in texture when the seaweed remains this crunchy. It reminds me of an onigiri, like a legit one. See, like usually when you have something like this, it's soggy up at the end, but this has a little crunch to it. And here that right when I'm biting it, it's so good. Mm. Right, this one looks awesome. Tempura, fried shrimp. Peel off the uh, tail first. I don't eat shrimp tails. I know some people do. Okay. Turn it out. Mm. 
that QP mayo is so good. Even the tempura remains crunchy. Could really make use of all the fresh ingredients. Mm. rolls do you guys or hand rolls do you guys usually eat when you go to a sushi restaurant you need this many it doesn't look like it was that much but having this much rice in each one it's definitely getting really filling ginger dipping in the soy sauce and putting it on top for a little bit of sauce. Try the spicy crab one. Ooh, excuse me. I had to get that burp in there to create more room. <laughs> the rice is so filling. Spicy crab is so mayo-y, so creamy. Mm. Did a really good job on that one. Wow, I think I really like this one. So far my favorite. Wow. And this one, they fill it all the way. Look at that. They give you so much spicy crab with this. It's filled all the way in. This reminds me of, it reminds me of when you're eating the ice cream cone with a little bit of chocolate at the end of the cone is what it's like, which is really cool. Mm, so good. Okay, that one by far is my favorite, but I actually saved this one for the last one because I love unagi. I love the eel sauce with avocado. But who knows, would I like that one or would I like this one more? Let me try it. Cause this one has like a really sweet teriyaki glaze on there. That's what the eel sauce tastes like. So let's give it a shot. Ooh, oh my God. That sauce mix is so good. It's like a teriyaki hand roll. I don't know, it's between this and the spicy crab.
Both are really, really good. I'm so happy I got, I actually saved the, the best two for the last. <clears throat> oh, this is awesome. I'm done with all the handles of the little mini handle challenge I created here. That was super duper awesome. And of course, this being a sushi place, they also have regular sushi rolls. So we're gonna try a little bit of that. But yeah, if you guys are ever in New York City, definitely check this place out. They have a few locations, I believe. But definitely the spicy crab and the eel are so good. All right, guys, I have a different kind of rolls in front of me. I have another layer right over here. Isn't that crazy? But yeah, we're gonna try this out just to see how it is. So first up, not eight, actually nine. We've got my favorite. I just finished off with this with the hand rolls. This is the unagi with the sauce again. Mm. That is so good. And the other one that I really like, the spicy crab. Look at that. Yeah, their spicy crab mixture is actually really good. Dude, I'm so spoiled. They definitely taste a huge difference because you see how it's rolled up like this? The seaweed already like sogged into like the rice. It makes a huge difference between like this and not crispy. Yeah, definitely the hand rolls with this being super fresh, tastes really different. Mm. I got some blue crab. Shrimp tempura, soy sauce, California mm. <clears throat> roll, veggie with the pickles. This one actually tastes a lot like kimbap, which is like the Korean version of sushi. Cause Korean, the kimbap usually uses a lot of this pickled um, vegetable in the wrapping. So you like kimbap. This actually tastes a lot like kimbap. It's really healthy, it's all veggies. fresh their stuff is like you can really taste the crunch of the vegetables and this one is the tamago again with the sweet egg mm. I really like that and yeah last but not least we got some cucumber the seaweed from the hand rolls to like do this and make like a seaweed burrito or something. <laughs> I'm just taking the rolls and rolling it up. <laughs> Let's try this. I really like the fresh seaweed. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this was awesome. Yeah, so that was super duper awesome. Again, if you guys are ever in New York City, definitely check them out. They also have a location in Dubai. How cool is that? But that hand roll seaweed wrap thing is patented. So only they have that in all of North America. So super cool to experience. Yeah, but if you visit, let them know I sent you. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.
thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And make sure to check out my website for all my merchandise. I've got clothing, prints, and stickers all up on there. And make sure to check out my social media, my Facebook page. Um, I do a lot of live streaming and on my Instagram page. I do a lot of giveaways and on my Twitter page. I also give a shout out to where I might be so you guys can kind of follow me on my journey, okay? And then check out my other videos. And again, make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.